Hello. This is a calligraphy video. I'm kind of just doing a quick little video on some of my calligraphy stash that I got from Five and Below. And I wanted to share it with you. I've just gotten into calligraphy. Well, I've always liked the idea of it. I just haven't ever done it. People told me you can't do it because you're left-handed. So I bought these kits from Five and Below. Both of them were $5 a piece, which I thought was pretty good. And I was like, even if they're saying I can't do it, I'm going to do it because what? It's $5. Okay, trying to get that angle right so you don't see my hand, but all the same. So this, uh, I bought on the same day, too. In fact, not only did I buy these two, but I bought this set, too. It was there on a later date. But just to show you first what's in these two, um, they're different but similar. Okay, this one, I actually pulled the items out. But if you want to see the box, it says that this kit contains a calligraphy art pen for nibs, six ink cartridges, plus a 48-page step-by-step book. So here's the pen, four nibs, and I took that off so you can see. Here's the book, and those are the cartridges. This one, pretty much same idea. This kit contains a pen, the callig calligraphic pen, two sides of nibs, 10 ink cartridges, plus a 64 page instructional and practice book. So I, um, like I said, pulled out the books. Here's this one. And if you ask, well, why did you buy two kits? Well, I didn't know first that they were going to have similar, the books are very similar. So whoever, um, did these kits, they pretty much use the same stuff, but it never hurts to have more than one. It's America. That's what we do. So this one came with a black pen, and this one came with this marbleized white one. And this one did come with extra nibs. Now, I'm new to calligraphy, so I can't really explain to you the big, big difference. But I know in looking at them that they, you know, of course, the strokes that they'll give you and the type of writing that they'll let you do. Let me put it on this white one so that you can really see, even though I have a shadow. And so... This one doesn't have the 10 cartridges because, of course, I've been playing with it before I did the video. I mean, I've had the kits for a while. So, just put those to the side. Let me just let you, I'm going to kind of let you scan through the um, books so you can see what's going on here. You know, I'm not going to try to um, infringe on anybody's copyrights, but... Um, you know, some of the stuff that they're teaching, it's similar. Let's see. Yeah, the people who did the book, Hinkler, if you can see that trademark there. Um, so they did this. I didn't look at it. I, I didn't care. It was $5. I mean, I don't know what the original price was. I don't know what they all would. Five the Lord gets their stuff. But obviously, they're getting their stuff from some other place, which may have sold it for more. And then they're getting, you know, the bulk. I don't know, maybe. I don't know how they do it. I, it, it. It doesn't matter. It was just $5. I mean, you're going to pay more than that. Now, here's some practicing that I did. I was trying to write the Lord's Prayer. And it's kind of like, even if nothing more, of course, it's not perfection. Because, one, there's no such thing as perfection. And, two, I was just starting out, just trying, playing around. And so... The book is a good idea, but of course, and I knew, I'm heavy-handed with ink in any way or anything, and so I knew there was going to be some bleeding, so I should have just copied, but I got another book, so I can always copy the next book, but I tried to do some flourishing, you know, I started trying to figure out, what is this, how do, you, how do people do all this fancy doodling, found out it was flourishing, and some of it is ornamentation, but I was doing some that I was used to doing over time. That I learned, you know, just playing around. So anyway, got in different sites. So I didn't want to mess up these pages. So I'll copy them. But it's showing you basically different types. And you know, we have the books. Library has books. Bookstore has books. I've got some from the books. I should have brought my books. So here again, the 23rd Psalm. So I at least have a copy of something that I did. So as I get better... I mean, this wasn't even trying to pretend to be um, calligraphy. What I was trying to do with this was I was really just trying to, I was just writing. 
this is sometimes my handwriting but you know with the pen it kind of manipulates your hand so it wasn't that my penmanship was bad but I would like to do calligraphy so yes this here it goes on to talk about flourishes and so I start understanding and doing lovely what is it lovely loops a site that the twins have and they have a class and I'm not advanced enough to want to take a class I don't know if you need to because either you are or you aren't I don't know if you get certified if you take a class I don't know if that matters but I know you can get jobs doing it and I'm actually met a lady one day while I was at Hobby Lobby who said she did some things for a friend who took it to work or some co-workers and then she got hired to do some work for a church and invitations and I've had people want me to just do invitations or thank you notes just based on my handwriting so anyway now this the other one I got uh, I think it's so cute this iridescent okay so this is how it looks it's cheap I mean five, five and below but it's cute so why not get it it came with these two pens and that's what it says count calligraphy fountain pens and it includes four ink cartridges <laughs> you know what's funny it says it's three dollars and 25 cents so i don't know if they charge me that or not <laughs> I don't know. it's funny though i may have paid five dollars for it I think I got this from Five Below. Did I get it from Five Below? I think I did. Yeah. I wonder if they charged me $5. Anyway, so on the back here, you know, I'll cry with that spill later. But um, it shows you how to um, insert the pens. I mean, the ink cartridges. I laugh at myself. I have to start checking prices. I'm thinking I'm getting deals and I'm getting duped. <laughs> Maybe not. We'll see. On a different day. But all the same. So here, plus the one that I just dropped, are my four cartridges. So, either way, I think it's a good idea. What this, what I do do with it is, I have this lady that sends me text messages every day. You know how they do those robo texts, and they have sayings about the days of the week, and um, you know scriptures and so she sends me those things every day so I was writing those down like I said um it wasn't anything grand they were cute enough but it was my handwriting I haven't been converted yet but those are some things I've just been using as quick ways to use my pens because who writes letters anymore but even if we don't write letters it still doesn't hurt to know how to write. Oh, let me tell you about this exciting pen that I probably again overpaid for. <laughs> but uh, my family was, um, we went to Chattanooga. It is um, COVID time and I really didn't want to go anywhere, but my husband managed to say, okay, we'll go outside and we'll go to Lookout Mountain and I'm unscrewing the pen. We'll go to Lookout Mountain and we'll be outside. So um, they say you can do outside activities. So I said, okay, 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 let's go. So we went to Chattanooga. And they have um, this market, this outdoor market. And anyway, <laughs> of all the days not to be able to get the pen off. So I bought this pen. And I paid more money than you should probably pay for a pen. But that's not Mont Blanc. <laughs> boo, boo, boo. And um, they tried to get me these other ones that they had. But um, I was like, no, you know, I said if I bought, if I saw a nice um, fountain pen, I would um, get it. Because I've been calling them calligraphy pens, which is the same thing um, to me. But I guess I should say fountain because there are the dips. And um, anyway, so I bought this pen. And, you know, it was another, two guys there. This one, he actually had matching seam rippers. And, um... I thought about getting a seam ripper, but I did not. It only came with this pen and a, and a, and it came with a, oh, this. If I wanted to do the refill well. And let me just tell you, I got plenty of inks. If you see my Jane Davenport, my Jane Davenport video, you know, I have plenty of ink. 
And in addition to that, I bought a lot of ink from Michaels, those big sets. I don't know how to do anything that <laughs> small. But I did got the both of the big sets of that um Indian ink. So I have plenty of ink. I haven't um filled it yet, but you know, I got plenty of ink. I I, I got dip pens, fountain pens. But yeah, so this one, like I said, it's um I don't know why today <laughs> of all days it's not opening. So, I've been carrying it in my purse. <laughs> I'm like, why? Hmm. Oh, only. Now, <laughs> all the same. You know, if you know me and you know my purse, anything could have happened. So, I bought it because it's purple. I need to stop letting purple be the reason I spend money.